Hello everyone and welcome to my channel, Time to Cook. I am Chef Christy. Okay guys, today I want to show you how to make four different kinds of jello salad. Now I love jello salad for many reasons. They are good any time of year. They can be made in a variety of flavors. They can be modified to sugar-free, uh, Weight Watchers friendly. They're just a good a uh, light snack or dessert, especially when you're watching your calories and trying to be careful about what you eat. They're just light, fluffy, fruity, and they are good. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit the notification bell if you want to be notified as soon as I upload new delicious recipes. The first delicious jello salad is an orange and pineapple. And it reminds me of an orange dreamsicle. It is oh so good. You will need one can of crushed pineapple, one can of mandarin oranges, one container of a whipped topping, one box of an orange jello, and I'm using one box of a sugar-free vanilla pudding. And you will need to measure out one cup of the juice from the oranges and the pineapple. Pour your juice into a large bowl, add your orange jello, and then whisk. Then add your pudding, whisking again until it's dissolved, and the mixture will become thick. Add your oranges and your pineapple, and finally add your whipped topping. I like to add pecans to mine. This is optional, but I like the crunch. And then you just need to mix this all together. The second jello salad is for a classic lime jello salad. You will need one can of crushed pineapple, one container of whipped topping, two boxes of lime jello one eight ounce package of cream cheese, and then pecans. Pour two cups of boiling water into your lime jello and whisk until all the jello is dissolved. And then begin adding your cream cheese. And I cut my cream cheese into large chunks. And then I'm using a whisk to kind of break this cream cheese up and stirring to incorporate that cream cheese into the jello. Add your pineapple with the juice and again stir to combine. Cover and refrigerate for two hours. After two hours add your whipped topping and your pecans and again stirring until it is all combined. The third kind of jello salad is for a delicious lemon jello salad. You will need two boxes of lemon jello, one large box of a lemon pudding, and then one container of whipped topping. Add two cups of boiling water to your lemon jello and stir until all the jello is dissolved. Add one and a half cups of milk to your pudding and stir until it is thick. And then take the pudding and add it to your jello and stir to combine both the jello and pudding. Cover and refrigerate for two hours. Add your whipped topping and then begin folding that whipped topping into your jello until it is all combined. And the fourth jello salad is the strawberry. You will need two cups of chopped strawberries, one container of whipped topping, 16 ounce container of cottage cheese, 
and two boxes of a strawberry jello. Add your jello to a bowl and then add your cottage cheese. Stir together. Add your strawberries and stir. Then add your whipped topping and stir again until everything is completely combined. And then cover and place in your refrigerator for a couple hours. Mm. Now, I'm not sure if I have a favorite of Jello salads or not because they are all so, so good. This is the strawberry, and I think it might be one of my favorites. I don't know. And it's crazy because there's not a lot of ingredients, but oh my goodness, it's delicious. I hope that you give some of these Jello salads a try, and let me know. Leave me a comment below and let me know what's your favorite. But thank you all so much for watching. I hope that you have a wonderful day, and as always, I will see you soon with more recipes. if you don't like cottage cheese.